Now for a personal thank you of mine to my beautiful wife, Mrs. Gerard, who looks absolutely stunning as ever today. Closest you'll get to a solid 10, I'd say. <laughs> <laughs> and today's probably the closest I'll ever come to admit I'm punching. <laughs> Oh, Rob's always took care of himself. In fact, they've got a mirrored ceiling when he gets a bit excited in the bedroom. It, it just blew me away. I mean, ladies and gentlemen, she looks a million dollars and I had to give her away. But <laughs> can you imagine the eBay fees? I promise to be there when you need me, to comfort you and encourage you, to help you reach your goals, to be your best friend and to love you all my life with all my heart. Can we do the Velociraptor dance? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. He's even let me his clothes in the past. He has a strict policy of things should be shared. <laughs> and I have benefited from this policy, haven't I, son? Oh. You know what I mean? Anyway. Oh. <laughs> I think you need to tell him that it wasn't. I can't go into it. Anyway. <laughs> into the Volvo truck and bus workshop. <laughs> Tall, blonde and beautiful. It was like love at first sight. The problem being, it was the same for the ten other lads that were there. <laughs> and I'm not going to go into the bet we had. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway, of course, as always, I was the best looking lad in the workforce. <laughs> so I just played it cool, went to Chorley every Saturday night. <laughs> and stalked her until she made the first move. <laughs> you know what they say, behind every good man is an even better woman. Hey, Sean. Get back to Ramsey Street, you. Go on. <laughs> yeah. Todd Landers, wannabe.